I have always postulated that we have to find a new way to deal with reality. A framework is important and designing is important. It could be spontaneous at times, but ultimately the final product matters. Roughly laying out the drawing on paper could save you tons of time. The concept was to create manga-inspired artwork. Painting a fantasy love story was fun, especially when you don't have one. First, I decided to paint on canvas. And I gave it a long thought. Just felt like a lot of work. I was devoted to paint the love story. So then I decided to paint on something which will be easier and which will be with me. It was clothes. I decided to paint on clothes. The quality of clothes is important and I did not know before I attempted this painting. I selected a wrong quality clothes and then I had to pay the price. It was uneven and it was difficult. I had to gesso it all over again, on the edges. Happiness is worthwhile. And love is too. Cutting some cloth and I was very happy that my bad quality clothes survived this stage. Ultimately, I decided to stitch it on the jacket after finishing my paintings. And that was a very bad idea. The cloth couldn't survive. I had to start all over again. This time with the same cloth, but with a better idea. 
I had to chop off all the edges again cuz they couldn't survive because of my first attempt with lack of research I painted roses to calm myself down from the previous calamity but something was missing I had to do enhancement with golden spangles Stitching wasn't the best idea especially when your cloth is thin and dying Ornamenting all the other pieces later on was my mission Due to the stupendous quality of the cloth I used it started buckling up from the edges I put them on for drying. They were ultimately looking good with the buckles. And I performed some more crafting on the flowers. It putting on some red highlights on them. I performed some more witchcraft in order for these pieces to perform well in the ultimate battle. Where you can be victorious only by dazzling the human eye. It was all looking extremely prodigious but the final challenge was still on the line that is to stick them on the jacket The ultimate thing which I found out was either you can paint on the jacket or you can stick your masterpieces by using fabric glue Fabric glue worked wonders for me. I decided finally to exhibit them by wearing the jacket. The front is looking all awesome and the back is too. The performance in front of camera in a video was not sufficient. I decided to take some snaps. I know you guys will return back to see some more witchcraft which can be done by subscribing to the channel. You can comment down below I subscribed and I will come back to you with a reply. Thank you for watching the video. See you in the next one. Bye bye.